I want you to feel 100% confident that like I'm going into this with the intention that Glow is gonna change my life. Anything less than that expectation, don't join because I am here to work with hustlers, dream builders, and doers. We are live. We're 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 live. What's up, beautiful people? Blog Like a Boss Cycle 4 is open and we've got 10 spots left. I am ready for Cycle 4. No offense to Cycle 1 through 3. I love you. Shout out to my Blab community, but Cycle 4 is getting me at my best. Glow is operating at an insane level of energy, motivation, and momentum. The people around me and the people with me right now are getting that. So you get eight weeks of live coaching with me through this Blog Like a Boss course. So we're hanging out for the next two and a half months. Very excited about the transformation. And so let's Let's first break down all the modules so that you guys know what you're getting into. If you have any questions, drop a comment, send me a DM, but let's talk about it. Okay, so the first module, and it's so important to talk about foundation. Like, I kind of sell you what you want, but I give you what you need. A lot of people are like, God, I blow, I just wanna make money. I wanna make money, I wanna make money. I promise you, I will help you monetize your brand. I will help you get there, but if that is your motivation, do not join this course because it is so much more than the money. I'm, I'm, I'm getting you guys to understand purpose and legacy here. Like, I don't want this to be a money pursuit. So if it is, I'm sorry, this is not the course or the community for you, but let's talk about what it is. Ah! Module one is all about branding yourself and your story. Branding, why is that important? Because as a blogger, you are not just someone who owns a blog and writes things on it. You are a brand, you're a personal brand, and you're a business brand, and I need you to understand the power of a brand. What I've done with my brand, I'm a personal brand. So at this point, I've done so much work with my content and with building my brand that I've built up such credibility and I've built up such a following and a passion for just loving what I do that people will follow me no matter what it is I go to next. Second module, audience growth and relationship building. Okay. Your audience, they are not numbers, they are people. If you go through any of my comments, go through any of my posts, you'll see that oftentimes I respond to people by their first name. Like I take the time to click on their username, look at what their first name is in their bio, and then go back to the comment section and say, oh my God, thank you so much, Sarah. And like just that added personal touch, like maybe it takes 10 extra seconds, but each person lets them feel validated, lets them feel seen, and I want people to have that feeling. Like you're just, when you watch my videos or you read my articles or anything like that, I don't take it for granted that people enjoy what I have to produce. Like without you guys, my brand is nothing. Social capital is so much more than the financial capital. Like social capital is everything. I've built my brand off of people being interested in what I have to say. So the minute I stop caring about the people who are supporting me, my brand is done. <laughs> I'm done. Module three, purpose-driven content and storytelling. Purpose-driven content and storytelling. Anybody can start a blog, anybody can start a business. Having a purpose behind the business and a purpose behind your blog, having a mission, it's rare. <laughs> Module four, now is where it starts to get juicy. Glow, what the heck am I worth? That's literally what the module's called. <laughs> but for this purpose, we're called valuation. How to know your worth. And I promise you, this is never gonna be a comfortable or easy thing, putting a price behind a passion. Like I, I tell people all the time, I had two years of unnecessary struggle because I was terrified to charge more than I thought people could afford. I was terrified to tell brands like, hey, buy my ticket, plus pay me this, plus all expenses, plus accommodate, like, whoo, I was just happy to be on the road for a little bit, you know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> I didn't know who I thought I was, trying to ask brands to pay me on top of the flight tickets and the hotels, and I would see that they're spending $10,000 just on me being there. I was terrified to put a number on top of that, because I'm like, who the hell am I? But when I get you guys to see the bigger picture and I get you guys to understand why value is important, and here's the biggest secret when it comes to valuation as well. People don't pay you what you're worth. They pay you what you think you're worth. So if you think you're worth 10 bucks, you'll get 10 bucks. If you think you're worth a thousand, you'll get a thousand. It's all about confidence and owning it. All right, module five, pitch templates and how to work with brands. So this is pretty cool. You guys get access to my entire portfolio of pitch templates. So what I send hotels, what I sell, send brands, what I send tourism boards. You guys are gonna get like the beta version of like what I'm gonna be sending moving forward because I think there is gonna be a lot of shift going on and so I think it's, it's important to be mindful of the time. So very excited about that. Module six, contracts and negotiating hacks. 
This is also really uncomfortable, but I'm an athlete. I was a double collegiate athlete in college. So I played basketball and tennis. And one thing about being competitive in nature, you almost carry that into like business. So I'm very competitive when it comes to like negotiating. If it's a brand that I'm like, okay, you've worked with someone of a lower quality. I'm kidding. <laughs> I see who you've paid before and I can do better work than them. Kidding. When it comes to contracts and negotiations, like you gotta find a middle ground. So the brand's job is to save money and your job is to make money. So you've gotta find that happy medium. And look, I'm gonna be honest, there's a lot of mediocre people with half your talent making twice as much money because they're doing something, they're working. No one has ever made money thinking about making money. <laughs> They do it, they fail, they stumble, they learn, they try again. It's it's cyclical. You gotta stop letting the idea of failure stop you from even trying. No one lucks or thinks or dreams their way to their goals. You gotta put in the work. All right, and module seven is all about search engine optimization, agencies, and tools. If you're someone who's like a beginner blogger and you're like stressed on SEO, like I promise you, having a personality and writing skills will trump SEO. Ew, I don't wanna use that word. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Don't let SEO be this big, scary, mystical thing that scares you. Okay, and then agencies. Agencies are good. Like having an agent and working with an agency are, are two separate things. But talking about agencies, um, a lot of them now, like you think of the big companies, the big wig companies, the Ubers, the Airbnbs, um, they don't have the time to be sorting through people's Instagrams to be figuring out which influencers they want to work with, which bloggers they want to hire. So they're going to these agencies with their big budgets and saying, look, find us your top 10 bloggers in this niche and yeah, we trust you. So of course the agency takes their cut. But what's cool about the agencies is they keep these Rolodex cards that they're like, yo, Glow did a great job in this campaign. Let's recommend it for these next four. Okay, let, 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 you know, and they just, they talk and they work together and they're able to say, okay, we know how much this brand is willing to spend because we worked with them last quarter. So they oftentimes work with bigger budgets um, and they, they get you more money than you could probably get on your own as an individual, you know, pitching yourself. Oh, I forgot to mention as well, I have my $20,000 negotiating tip in module six. So that one is also huge. And last but not least, we we have module eight, all about business strategies and monetization. This is probably the one module that people actually buy the course for, and it's filled with nuggets. I break down all 17 of my revenue streams and kind of let you guys see like the behind the scenes of my business and give you guys ideas on how to start yours and developing a money menu and an ecosystem for products. So. <laughs> all right, and then the bonuses. We love bonuses. Okay, we get eight weeks with me. <laughs> What? <laughs> all this energy, you guys see all this energy? It has been like this, all quarantine. <laughs> like, I don't know what to do with myself. Like I do, but then I don't. So it's, it's exciting to like be around people who are like, Ugh, you know, on this path and are driven and are motivated and are ready to build. So um, you guys get eight, eight weeks with me in a time like this. I think it's that's gonna be in itself really special. You also get my ebook. <laughs> You get some of my past presentations, you get my top 10 like podcast episodes for like money mindset, and most importantly, the community, the private Slack community where you have direct access to me, and then the joint community where after you go through the course, you get to meet the rest of the Blab people. But I do want to keep it limited, I want it to be intimate, and I want us to be able to actually like get to meet each other, get to know each other, get to remember each other, and it's going to be like a hangout. We're going to be hanging out every Sunday, so um, it's going to be pretty cool. I'm excited, guys, I'm excited, so. <laughs> And I'm doing a fast action bonus. I love to reward the doers, the people who go off of instinct. Like, you know what? I'm, I'm finally ready to do this. I see Glow's been doing her thing. Fast action bonus, you get a free one-on-one -on -one business strategy call with me before the course starts. I get to kind of do a business audit, look at your Instagram, look at your blog, and kind of see what's going on there. And kind of give you my feedback. And I promise you, like, I am just as anxious and as worried as you guys about the future of the world, because pff, let's be honest, like, nothing is gonna be the same after this. Like, I am anticipating some major changes in the world, and it's gonna be for the better, though. It's gonna be for the good. I think we needed this hard reset. Like I. I don't know what's gonna happen, but I'm the kind of person that I embrace change. Um, I embrace the pivot. I'm always like, okay, look, I can't control this, so let's focus on that. You know, I, I can't worry about that. So I like to be around people who are active, who are doers, who are like, you know, let's make the most of what we do have. So if you are ready to build, so just a quick recap. So we've got branding, audience growth and relationships, purpose-driven content and storytelling, valuation, pitch templates, contracts and negotiation, SEO agencies, business strategies, eight weeks of life coaching, my ebook, past presentations, and the private coaching community. And please do not feel pressured to join. Like I'm a mess, I'm excited, but like, pfft.
this is just me. I'll be here tomorrow. I'll be here next month. Don't worry, this course ain't going nowhere. I do not want you to feel pressure to join. I want people who are 110% committed to change and to building and to growth and that's the people I wanna be around. So mm, if that is you, hit the link in my bio. You know what to do. Welcome and uh, I'll see you inside.